So there's a thing on copy as a citation outside of Reader related to sharing things from a PDF. So the idea is that here's the original text that has been copied. When you copy from Reader today, you also get this visual meta, which is exactly a bibtech. It's exactly the same thing called a visual meta because it's part of that ecosystem. I also think we should add the document name so it'll be easy to find exactly where this came from. Of course, it needs some quotes. So the idea is to make it prettier, more human friendly, maybe format it like this, maybe even remove the bibtech slash visual meta so that this is all that's there as long as it's parsable. But then here's a really interesting thing. If I, whoops, if I copy this, go into an email, paste this, and send that. Then when I get an email with this, this little bit here is an automatic Google search. If I just click on that, now I won't find it in this case because I haven't uploaded this to the web anywhere, but you can see it's doing a correct search based on the name of this article. Uh, I tested it on other documents that are from ACM and so on, and it definitely works. So the question is how to format this citation bit when going to a normal environment. Uh, this is how it should look ideally, that's pretty. Uh, if you want it to be academic, it could look like this. Of course, an author, if you paste it and turn it into a uh, paragraph, this is what it'll look like, it'll still export properly. So that's what I'm looking at now, what to include in the visual bits that can be used in emails and normal Word documents and so on for citations to help the dialogue between uh, different people having these kinds of discussions. Thanks for looking.